All right, thank you very much, Leslie. Well, right now, Washington State Senators Maria Cantwell and Senator Patty Murray, one step closer to accomplishing something the Spokane Tribe says is long overdue. And this morning, Grace Chapin joins us with the story. Good morning. Well, the issue is the tribe being compensated for land taken by the U.S. federal government to build the Grand Coulee Dam. Back in the 1930s when the dam was built, that brought an end to the Columbia River salmon that fed the tribe for centuries. It also caused the tribe to lose about 40% of their homes and flooded more than 3,000 acres. The original bill called for $53 million to be paid to the tribe, along with annual payments from the Bonneville Power Company. But recently, in hopes of moving legislation forward, the tribe agreed to forego the $53 million payment. Maria Cantwell tweeted, These lands are of significant spiritual and cultural value to the Spokane people, and after more than 60 years, it's time they get the just and equitable compensation they deserve. The, d the bill did pass out the committee, but they're still waiting for a date for it to be heard before the House and Senate. I'm Grace Chapin, back to you in the studio. All right, thanks very much, Grace.